you when you are still a virgin. And wants to send you out to bring in another maiden because you gave him just one child. Yes. I don't go on a mission without full confirmation because when I start, I will never turn back. This is exactly what happened. <laughs> No, no. Where is your son? Huh? He went to the farm. I have asked you several times who the father of that boy is. You say he is mine. But his attitude doesn't look like mine. Nine. What is it again? I was at the farm throughout today. But there was no sign of him. Oh. Where did you tell me you are going this morning? I told you I was going to the farm. Mm -hmm. Your father here said he did not see you near the farm this morning. Hey. Mama, this is the problem with you. Did I tell you I was going to Papa's farm? Huh? It could be another person's farm. Farm is farm. What is your problem? Ah, okay. okay, you see exactly what I'm saying. Eh? You see exactly what I'm saying. I go for number two. I go do. I go for number two. Give me another child, or I marry another wife. Nay, it has not gotten to that too. Papa, you said you want to marry another wife. Exactly. Into this house. It will last. You are not challenging, you are not challenging me. You. In my own house. I have told you. I have told you. I have told you. Why you not my work? I have not challenged you. I have not challenged you. This is a good Hey! Don't tell me. I don't want to know who she is. I don't want to know what she's here to do. If she does not leave this place this minute, this house will not contain you and I. Akudo, are you out of your senses? Have you forgotten that I, I, I am your husband? I'm in my right senses. But I will lose it if she does not leave this house. Hey, Akudo, shut up. Let me tell you who she is. I don't want to know. Is it by force? I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Uh, leave. Or is it by force? Leave this house. Let her leave. Come on. Leave my house. Oh, leave my house. I don't want you here. Leave. Why is she acting this way? I told her that I want to get another wife. That's why she sounded like this. <laughs> <laughs> but you have every right to get as many wives as you want. Uh -uh. Let's go. Let's go in. What is going on here? Eh? What are you doing in my kitchen? I'm trying to prepare breakfast. How dare you? How dare you? Oh. You think you can come into my house and snatch my husband away from me? You have failed. I said you have failed. Eh? Leave my kitchen. Akudu, what is wrong with you? How are you acting this way? Oh, you still have to go to talk back at me, eh? Listen, eh? Listen. You, are you out of my kitchen? Are you mad? I can get out. Get out. Get out. Uh -uh. What is going on here? I told you I will make this house all conducive for her. I was trying to prepare breakfast. Uh-huh. She came and started harassing me. Why is you I will make this house unconditional for you? Didn't I? I tried to explain to her. She, she slapped me. What? <laughs> Akudo! You slapped her! <laughs> what do you want me to do to your husband? No, not my husband. The maiden. I want Adamarama to kill her for me. 
She only came to destroy my family. I want you to kill her. Go. Your wish will be granted. Eh? Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. I said go. I just told you. That is exactly how to do it. And you make a mistake. Yes. Really? Yeah. Very simple. You know, I thought it was very hard to ask. Well, let me tell you, not as easy as you think because at the starting point your body will shake. Yes. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Anyways, what time? No, my. That was how Begali touched him the other day. He nearly fainted. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, for Oh, yeah, for real. Oh, yeah, for Ah, thank you. How are you? Fine. Please, can I see your side? Me? Yeah. Now, I want to kill you with some mouth. Eh, I want you to do it to me what you did to get you. I don't get you. It's now on me. Thank you. Do you remember you're my friend's younger sister? Okay. Since you don't want to do it, I will go ask Okoro and Oka for it. Okay. No problem. No, no, no. Okay. Okay. Azubike. Azu. Azubike. Aha. Ezu bo mmade. Chiolo. I can see you're working very hard today. What are you doing here? Ah. Uh, is me or no? Don't treat me like that. Or is it because of what happened last time? Ichiolo. Biko. Ejin chukwa abia mayoki. With all due respect, can you leave my farm? Continue to where you're going. Uh, Azubike, I should leave your farm, Biko. So you don't want to be my son-in-law again? You said you don't want an ordinary farmer like me. That you want a farmer with a plenty plantation and, uh, and, uh, and palm trees. Yes, I said that only because I just want to save my daughter's life. What do you mean? Yes. You see, as of then, you cannot marry my daughter and deflower her because of the situation of our land. Ishi, are you saying that Adugo has been deflowered? Not what I mean. Now come, let me explain something to you. Come. Mama, you called me. Yes. I heard that you refused to eat since morning. I am not hungry. My son, what is the problem? Talk to me, I'm your mother. Mama, how can father go into the meeting with elders to discuss about me getting married without even consulting me to find out if I'm willing to get married? Ubinna, are you trying to tell me that you're not happy? We want you to get married? Or don't you know that you're supposed to be married by now? Kerefina, Akose. I know I should be married by now, but not the responsibility of father to help you find a wife. I'm not going to my friend, shut up. Shut your mouth. It is the duty of the king and his elders to choose who is good for you. For the future king. A beautiful maiden. At that. Yes. Mama. What if I tell you that I have found one? The untold part of African beauty. A very beautiful maiden with lots of wisdom. One that gladdens my heart. You know, I'm trying my best to look very beautiful. <laughs> mm. I couldn't tell how you were about you today. Mm. Oh, don't worry. I promise soon I will tell him. Yes. Do you think they will like me? 
Why not? Oh God, the quag. Oh God, the quag. Oh God, the quag. Come on. Don't mind her. When she realizes whom you are, she will seek your face. Well, my advice to you is to tell him that you don't have any plan for him. Eh? That if he wants to be your friend, he can be your friend. Mama, I have tried severely to warn him off, but he keeps coming around. I think you should tell him. Begali, I'm done. Can we go now? Chai. Thank you, my son. Thank you, Mama. Mama, thank you very much for the advice. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Maybe God bless you. that has stolen your eyes. Who is this maiden? I have never seen her in this village before. My prince, she's the daughter of Ichi Anozi. Say what you know. My prince, her name is Obegeli, the daughter of Asha Lugo. That old witch that killed her husband and her children. In that case, why didn't she kill this very one? Maybe she's a witch too, my prince. He's lying. He's lying. We shall find out. If I burn up on a new become a man, and that shall I die. If I burn up on a become a man, and that's a lot My prince, you don't need to jump into a conclusion without finding out the truth. She might have a reason of being close to her. My prince, for your safety, don't listen to this empty brain. Find the ask. 
please go ahead. Why are you so interested in knowing this media? I don't even know. But I'm yet to find out. My prince. It seems you like her. Do you think so? find out. Greetings, my prince. How are you? I'm fine, my prince. My prince. We weren't expecting you. Hope all is well. Well, all is well. I'm, I'm only expecting an elder. Oh, that must be my father, Ichi Anozie. Ichi Anozie? Your father? Yes, my friends. I thought they said you are the only surviving child of Achalugo. <laughs> um, not really, my prince. People think so because I'm the only one going there to help her. You may go, please. Thank you. Good afternoon, my friends. Good afternoon. Um, sorry, um, please, let my guards help you with the log of firewood. My prince, you must not let other men go against their wish. Uh, you shouldn't worry. I mean, they are my guards. They are at my services. Exactly my point, my prince. They are at your service, not mine. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, but I, I, I insist. I, I want to help you. Let me help you carry the firewood. My prince, if you want to help me, you, you can do it yourself and not to ask someone else to do it for you. Do you, do you realize what you just said? That I, Prince Obina, should carry the log of firewood. You are actually talking to your future king. Your king. With all due respect, my prince, Human sanity has nothing to do with positions in life. By leading your people, you must serve them as well. My prince, are you tired? No, I, I, I am not tired, but this is, this is the much I can go. Just admit you're tired, my prince. Huh? Um, even if I'm tired, this is the much I can go. You know, because of my father, the king. Okay, understand. I just. Okay. Oh. Oh. oh, my prince, can you help me? Oh. Um, thank you very much, my prince. Uh, please, I... one, one more thing. Will I see you tomorrow? If the goddess allows. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Did you laugh? No, no my prince. prince. No. no. Why are the both of you laughing? No, my prince. No, no. Let me have that. that. Now, the both of you, listen up. You did not see anything. 
Do you hear? Yes, my friends. My son, the prince, the heir apparent to the throne of Ikoro land, the future king of this land, was seen carrying firewood on his head. Is it true? Me? Prince Obina? The future king of Ikoro land, seen carrying firewood on his head. I mean, father, who fed you such lies? Let me rip his truth out. I mean, if I needed firewood, I have guards with me. I can ask them to go get me firewood. I better see the carrot if I have need to. It's okay. <laughs> I will make the truth closer to you. Were you at any time seen in town today with any maiden? Father, is it not obvious that my enemies are at work? I never knew I've grown to that extent where people will begin to conspire against me. Uh, well, um, in respect to the issue about seen with a maiden, that's true. But, uh, I, but I can explain that further, please. <laughs> Listen, Obina. If you had told me you wanted a wife, you could have just quietly told me. I would have just discussed with the elders and made an arrangement to get one for you. Um, I... Leave my presence. Amongst you stood my father that was helping a maiden to carry firewood in this village. Who? You? No, 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 you it? no, 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 you know, he, he talks too much, it must have been him. You, no, my you, friend, you, is, you, is, is this true? Is this true? You, I, I, I always know that you should disappoint me. You cannot even do the secret. I told you that. Did you say anything? You said no. <laughs> I know it must have been you, you talk to one. You see? <laughs> um, why do you always help that old woman? I feel for her. Like, I pity her a lot. The villagers abandoned her and she has been suffering. You're such a nice person. <laughs> <laughs> yes, of course you are. And, um, Thank you. I would love to ask you a question. What? And I asked her to marry me. And what is this thing? The truth is, every maiden in this village knows what you want. Eh, uh, since you, you, you already know what I want, why don't you just uh, allow me to do it? Ah, uh, wait now, why are you angry now? Uh, listen, uh, you know very well that uh, even if the prince does it, he won't still marry you. Somebody else has to do it for the prince to marry you. I am the best in this kind of thing now. Adugum, your father said that the Igwe and the others have devised a means to avoid the wrath of Adoma. You see, I can deflower you and come back in the next two market days and marry you. Thanks. Why is your face like this? Azubike, I can't believe this, Azubike. I cannot believe that my father would deceive in such manner. Adugum, I don't understand. You don't understand? Azubike, my father wants you to def deflower me so that he can marry me off to another man. Adugo, that's not what he told me. My love, you should know better. If this is true, I will be the one to tell you. I will be the one to come to you. My father just wants to play you. Can't you understand? Adugo. You're sure of what you're saying? I'm very sure. You're sure of what you're saying? Azubike! Oh God, they fall, fall. Oh God, they fall, fall. Oh God, they fall, fall. Oh God, they fall, That young girl, Ugoma, 
is the daughter of my sister who was married to another village. I brought her to this village because I know she would be a perfect match to the prince without worries of Adam Adama. I'm taking her to Igwe tomorrow morning. Two. Yes. Akudo! Ah, Akudo! <laughs> Why did you lie to me? Lie what? Lie to you about what? Wait, 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 wait. Are you trying to tell me that my daughter has been deflowered? No, wait, let me ask. Did it enter immediately? Womb. Came and back on and put the name your dazier me. You want to use me to deflower your daughter? and now give out to another man. That is not true. I am not lying to you. Go and deflower my daughter and come back in two market days for her hand in marriage. I'll come back in two market days and I'll do what you ask of me. Azubike, come back and do it now. You may never get the opportunity of doing it with my daughter again. Uncle Dad only sees that I'm uncle. Papa, you're back. Yes, my dear. I'm back. Papa, you look worried. What is it? Um, I will try what I can to make sure the prince marries you. Hmm? All you have to do is to look for a young man in this community to deflower you. Mm -hmm. eh? Papa, you should know your daughter very well. When you told me about the prince this morning, I did what should be expected of me. You don't mean it. You mean you have done it. Yes, Papa. <laughs> that is my daughter. I'm really proud of you. Thank you. Hmm? Now it's now my turn to do what I'm supposed to do. Hmm? Papa, are you going? Hey, let me just go in. Right, I'm coming. Take something. Out. <laughs> <laughs> we need to celebrate. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Um, um, you told me that the prince wants to marry you. So what is happening? Anya to Kwanamnezi. Papa, you don't need to worry. If the goddess says Prince Obina will be my husband, nobody can stop it. My dear, it's not as if I am worried. It's just that I want you to be very careful. Mm. Papa, um, I promise to be very careful. Thank you. So, have you had something to eat yet? No, no. Uh, what do you have in the house? Okay, I'm preparing something. Uh, good. Let me go get some. Good. Ada, please. Ada, please, I am begging you. Please don't touch her. Ada, please don't touch her. Oh. Please spare her life. Ada, please don't touch her. Ada, please. It is all my fault. I never knew she was my husband's needs. Please, please. I am begging you, Ada, please don't touch her. Please spare her life. Ada, please spare her life. Ada, please. I am begging you, Ada. Ada, please. I am begging you. It is all my fault. I am sorry. Oh. Timo, what have I done? And I am begging you. Ada, please, I am sorry. Please. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Since you have refused to do what I said, 
I am going to show you that I'm your father. I will deflower you with my fingers. Papa, 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 I said, get inside. Get inside. Papa, leave me alone, Mama. Are you going to stand there and do nothing, Mama? Mama, are you going to stand there and do nothing? I do go. Do what your father asks you to do. Udo Chia, I won't do it. Papa, 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 leave me alone. What is going on here? My sister has refused to deflower, so I'm going to do it myself. Papa, 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 that's wrong now. That's wrong. Adugo is no longer a child. You can't force her to do what she doesn't want to do. Adugo is no longer a child. It's not the matter. The most important thing is that they are all right. Yes, after all, uh, Giru did it with Ikebuna today. Hmm? Papa, what did you just say? What did you not hear? What did you not hear? Huh? That I'm going to deflower her with my finger today. Or that he did it with Ikebuna. Anumpa. Papa! Papa, 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 I beg you, I'll do anything, anything you ask me to do. Please, spare her life, I beg you. I heard you. You may go now. Thank you. Thank you very much, Adamarama. Thank you. In time, I will teach you. You know, you, you are amateur. Huh? Calm down. How is it done? Let me tell you. When I was entering, it was as if I was going to heaven. Hey. I, mm. I swear. Hey, calm down. I will teach you. But with time, not now. If that be the case, one of these days, I will try it. You will try it? Yes. Only me. You, you said it's painful. At times, it could be painful. Yeah. Yes, yes, but you still enjoy it at the end. Hey, nothing good comes easy you now. Pain before sweet. <coughs> Is it? <laughs> okay, 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 stop, okay, okay, stop, okay, 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 What is this? This is now. It's okay, it's okay. What, what, what happened? What happened? She deflowered my sister. Who? I'm going to get me to the other. If I'm going to put a little bit, become a little bit. I don't know. Adoma. You have succeeded. Killing all my children. I'm afraid I don't want to die. I don't want to be deflowered by anyone else. It is you I love. Listen to me. Nothing will happen to you. The only problem I have right now is to get my father to convince him to allow me marry you. Once that happens, every other thing is settled. Adoma is going to kill me if I try to marry you. Adama is not really the problem here. 
I can handle her. My king, I used my fingers and deflowered her. In fact, I inserted three fingers at once to make sure that uh, it is wide open for the prince because I know that the prince is endowed with uh, <laughs> in cassava. <laughs> in fact, Honor, you did the right thing. At least you saved us the stress of having to silence somebody for life and have blood on our hands. <laughs> My thing, when are you coming so that I can go and prepare? That is true. Uh, you know it's going to be a royal wedding. Yes. Uh, so huh? let me say three market days from now. Uh, okay. I'm going to say that 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 <laughs> Let me go and start preparations. Igwe. <laughs> 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 sister what if something had gone wrong in the process how could you have faced me as your friend that is why I'm apologizing I'm so sorry but you know your your your, your sister is irresistible it's okay it's okay stop sorry sorry you have the ghost to sit before me and for me this trash after all you did to my sister sorry it's sorry Sorry, don't get it wrong. Eh? I was there when it all happened. Even, your, it, it's not Ikebuna's fault. Your sister vowed that if Ikebuna refused to do it with her, that she will look for someone else that will do it. Sorry, no. Operator, my. My. The Prince of Ikoro land will soon be our son. My. It's okay, <laughs> Hey! I can't wait for that day to come. Yes. Hey! Yes, Digwe asked me to go and start preparations. That uh, very soon, Adugo will be a queen. Hey! Yeah, when I will not be a queen. Yeah, when I will not be a queen. Yeah, when I will not be a queen. Papa, no. No, no, no. This is unfair. Papa, no! No. I deflowered before Adugo. I deflowered before her. Papa, no. I even did it willingly, not like her when you were forced to do it. Hey. Papa, I'm the one that's supposed to marry the prince, not her. I'm the one. Hey. Your daughter, you are right. Hmm? But this is a matter of interest and nature. The prince is interested in her book, not you. <laughs> so you have to understand. Huh? Okay. Okay. Hey. Father, why is it that you don't want to see reasons with me to accept the fact that I have found a maiden that gladdens my heart? Young man, it is not about a maiden who gladdens your heart, but about a maiden who befits this throne of the land of Ikoro. Your Highness, don't you think Obina might have made the right choice? Please listen to him and know who this maiden is. I do not want to know who this maiden is. I have already made a choice for him and that is final. I have spoken. You may both leave. You heard me. Papa. Papa, 
Azubike, what are you doing? Ichiwonoa. What are you doing with my daughter? Simi Ichiwonoa. I am in Sopo. I've come to tell you that I want to marry Adogo. You know what you are? You are an idiot. Hmm? A punctuated fool. So, you, you want to reap where you did not sow? Eh? I called you to come and open the door and you refused. I opened it myself and you want to move in with your property. Will you get out of my house before I redirect your destiny? Ichuna, why are you sounding like this? Papa, why are you doing this to me now? Eh? Papa, why are you doing this? Azubike here is the only man I love. Will you shut up? And he's the one I want to... Michuna, Anum, Papa, what do you know about love? Eh? Azubike is the only one I want to love. Look at someone you will marry is not man enough. You want to marry someone who is not man enough? Eh? What are you still doing here? Can you see? What, what, why are you sounding like this? Azumika, what are you still doing here? I've come to tell you, I want to marry Adug, and you, you know I love her. It's alright, no problem. No problem. Uh, okay, you can go. Tell my myself. Mbanya, dear sir. Just take her inside and uh, relax yourself. Huh? It's no problem, it's okay. Why are you sounding like this? No problem, just go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, there's no problem. Ichi, Ichi, you know how much I said, I love go you. ahead, take her inside. Why is your father acting like this? Azubike, take her inside. Huh? Take her inside. Take her inside. Come! Look at the person you want to marry. Look at it. He cannot even face me. He's a coward. Huh? Baba, I don't like I'm not I'm only for pasta. I don't like it. Listen, forget this. That, 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 that. You say the prince of Binna is coming to marry you in three market day. Be. Be. This is Ugoma. She is the youngest daughter of my elder sister, Azoka. Who was married to Umaka village many years ago? Oh, 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 oh. That was many years ago. Ugoma, how are you? I'm fine. Beautiful girl. Um, Igwe, I thought it myself. With all the things that is happening in this our village, mm. our prince deserves to marry a virgin maiden. I then decided to bring my my sister's daughter who is from another village. She's the only girl that is fit for the prince. <laughs> Madoka, the matchmaker. <laughs> well, she's a beautiful girl and uh, I have not thought of it before but uh, I see that she's qualified to be the queen, future queen of this land. Yeah, not only that, I say that because <laughs> the blood of Ikoro land runs in her. Oh. Don't you have fear in your eyes? You are the greater woman on our On the morning, bend them on number some poor. We are not going to be able to do this. We are going to be able I will only spare you for reasons best known to me. Do not push your luck next time. And 
Papa is not home, but he will soon be back. God forbid, you will not die, okay? Don't worry. Papa will soon be back. I want to see you before I die. No, no. Stop mm -hmm. talking like this. You will not die. You know, go. Hi. My husband. My husband, where are you? Please come back. Because you know. Because you know, come back. My father told me that Udene will be coming today. Yes. That he started everything does not mean he can end it. Hmm. Okoro is right. I don't see any end to all these troubles. My brothers, I want you to reason with me. We should not lose hope in a better tomorrow, okay? There is a total end to every problem in life. All our tribulations, there must be a day it will come to an end. Believe me. But I just pray that this whole thing ends soon enough before my born child and Nkiru die. Honestly. Oda Ntapue Ntapue Ntasa Oda Ntapue Ntapue Ntasa Ntasa Ntjelokwa Oda Kwa Ntapue Take her in The flower her The flower her Ntapue Ntasa, ntapu, ntasa. Collect the blood on this white cloth and bring it to me. Go. Oda, ntapu, ntapu, ntasa, ntasa, ntjalowa. Oda kwa ntapu. Ntapu, ntasa. Go. Igwe. Oda, ntapu. I am Udene. Udene. Kawaka. Oda, ntapu. Adama, show your face to me now. Show your face, you evil spirit. Show your face to me now! Oda Ntapue. Otapue Ntasa. You are a god. But I, Udene, made you a god. Oda Ntapue. Ntapue Ntasa. Ntjalokwa Oda Kwa. Ntapue Kwe Ntasa. Oda Ntapue. Oda, ntupue, ntupue, ntasa, ntasa, ntjalokwa, no ya dakwa. Show yourself. Udene, Udene. Ha 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 ha!
Oh, da! 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 What is going on? Oh, da! Obina, oh, da! 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 Oh, Obina! Oh, da! Oh, da! Oh, da! Oh, da! Oh, Mama, my father said, you know the reason why she loves me but won't let me marry. <laughs> Do you believe, just believe you are the reason she's doing all this? They said you have the solution to all this. Mom, tell me. Um, Igwe, I think it's high time you summon the cuckoo. Oh, you're correct. Because the cuckoo is the only hope we have. Just thinking. Don't you think we should look for another solution? Do you have any other suggestion? Honestly, I do not. But, okay, maybe we should just summon the cuckoo. Oh? Yeah. I am so disappointed in you. How could you be this heartless? I took you as a mother, yet you don't see me as your daughter. Maybe the villagers were right after all. Maybe you were indeed a witch. Forgive me. I wish you knew what I have passed through in life. You wouldn't have told me those words. Mama, that is what I want to know. Please tell me. I will tell you. But not today. Wait, Mama. I will tell you when I will tell you. I Ikuku, a lot has happened in our land. We need your help. Adoma, a sacrifice turned into a goddess is tormenting this land. What do we do, Ikuku? Go back 
to where you're coming from. Else, you will never be able to return again. You can't kill me. I am a being among the gods. Unlike you, who do worse among the living. You do not have a place here. And I do not have a place wherever you came from. So go back before I change my mind. Oh, what up? 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 Ota, 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 Natasha, Ota, 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 Sa. I don't know. I don't know. Igwe, don't you think it's time we confess to the villagers and see if that will save our people? Yes. Eh? Say, do you know the consequences of telling the people what happened? Yeah. Your Highness, that is no longer important. Um, uh, Your Highness, please, I am sorry. Pardon my high tone. It's not as if I am shouting at you or to the cabinet. But what I am saying is that that consequence is no longer important. We, we don't have hope of living any longer. Our people deserve to know the truth. Igwe, 
Anozier is right. Onwaha has gone. Nobody knows his whereabouts. He told us he went to look for help. It's Etmos now. Nobody knows his whereabouts. He deceived us and ran away. Uh, perhaps uh, Ad Adama killed him before he could reach our, uh, our help. Nobody knows. Maybe all hope is not lost. How? Maybe the solution to our problem is here. We need to do something. We need to do something to put an end to all this once. Yes. Evil prevails when the youths do nothing. See, uh, I have a problem here because no matter what we do, we can't get the truth from the head as an end. We are talking about something very vital here. We are talking about the Ugo and the elders. So what are we talking about here? Who in this village does not know that that witch is responsible for all our trouble? You mean our Chalugo? See, 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 see. I'm, if, if the others are afraid of her, I'm not afraid though. I'm not afraid at all. We need to catch her and deal with her mercilessly. Rubbish. I'm strongly of the opinion that if we should succeed in killing Achalugo, the spirit of Adoma will rest in peace. Take me to the shrine. Ah, shrine? I will uh, instruct my guards. No, to... Igwe. You and your elders will take me to the shrine. Hey! What's one? She want us seriously never to come anywhere close to her shrine. Yes. You are afraid to die when you should be courageous to correct your mistakes. Now, take me to the shrine. Um, oh no. Uh, complete the journey you started. Yes. yes. Uh, to the shrine. My brothers. <coughs> I don't think this is right. Ikebunna, it seems that that woman has bewitched you. Yes, because you are no longer with your senses. Yes. Oh, he has joined the secret chamber of our Igwe and our fathers. That's not true. The thing is, eh, I have this strong feeling that there is more to this that we don't know. It's now quite obvious that you do not have feelings in my sister. You do not care if she lives or dies. But let me tell you something. If anything happens to my sister, if anything happens to my sister, you will not be alive to tell the tale of what will happen to you. How dare you come to challenge me? Didn't they tell you what I did to the others before you? I have not come to challenge you. I have come to have a word with you. Leave my presence. Leave my presence before I burn you with fire. I won't leave until I have a word with you. Then you leave me with no option. You got it, gang. You got it, gang. What power do you have? The same power as you do. The power of a heartbroken virgin. What do you know of a heartbroken virgin? Because I am like you. Much more like you. Do you know the pain? Do you know the pain the people you've come to save made me go through? Tell me. Tell me about it and I will understand. It happened. A long time ago, even before you were born. Nay, 
Mr. Soma. Adam Maramba, how are you? I'm fine, Uncle. Where are you going this morning? I'm going to fetch firewood. Okay. When you get home, tell your father I'm coming to see him later in the day. Okay. okay. Bye. How did you know I was here? My instinct told me you will come here this morning. And I went to your house to look for you. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Um, do you know what? Let us do it here. Do you think I went to look for you because of that? I know, but I can't wait to have it with you now. Hmm? Am I not your husband? See, I have been waiting all my life. Yes, you are my husband. But the traditional rites are not yet complete. I'm still a virgin. And, and I'm all yours. When, when the rites are complete, then you can have me all to yourself. What is the difference? What? Please, no. Well, the difference is clear. Come, let's go. Get up. It is said that Osisi Kanko took the spirit of our gods with him when he died. Our land has suffered so many calamities since Osisi Kanko died. Udene, we need you to restore the spirit of our gods, to restore our great oracle, and to restore our shrine. Order into poor. Order into poor. Ntupue Lisa. Ntupue Lisa. What you have asked of me is an easy task. But a very difficult duty for all of you here. <laughs> with, the, uh, with the level of calamity that has befallen this land, there is nothing we cannot do. It's nothing. Okay. We will do whatever it takes to restore the spirit of the gods so that our land can have law and order once more. In that case, we will begin with taking a blood oath of life and death. Whatever it takes to restore the gods will remain a secret between Igwe and Indichi. Forever! Forever and ever! Mama, mm. when sister gets married, I want you and papa to get me a wife. I won't be able to do all the chores in the house. <laughs> yes. mm. Mama? Yeah. Okay. Uh, we are here. Welcome. 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 You should be preparing for your final traditional rite and not follow your wife around as if she is running away. Papa, when you love your wife, hmm? you can do anything for her. Love. When I listen to children of nowadays talk about love, it makes me laugh. Why, Mama? In our own days, in our own time, I never got to see your mom until the final traditional rite was over. Papa, did you love Mama? Of course I do. Um, no, I mean, before you got married. <laughs> no. I did not set my eyes on your father until I was asked to give him a drink. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, Papa, I have to go now. <laughs> Let me just take it. Go ahead, help yourself. I'm allowed to go home to go and warn my family, since I am the only one among them with a grown-up child, and that is why I have come here to warn you, because you are my brother. When you took a blood oath just to seal this secret, I'm only telling you because you are my brother. And I am very sure you won't even let your wife know about it. So I am going. Of course I am. 
We have the package. We will do everything today. Yes. Today. You agree with me? Yes. yes. We will do everything today. Are you sure everything is settled now? Yes, I am sure. And the ritual will take place any moment from now. That is why I am going to the shrine to respect the work. I hope you have to know what you are trying to do. Because I see this and it looks like a sacrament. <laughs> yes, my brother. You see, somebody has to pay for the price and progress of this land. Yes. Who brought my daughter here? Who? Gee, I don't know that it's your daughter or... Papa, eh? what is going on? This man kidnapped me. You mean you went into my house and kidnapped my own daughter? Eh? Eh? Gee, we, we, we didn't go to your house. And we don't have any idea that this girl here is your daughter. Okay, Ontaya. Now, immediately. What you want us to do is against the instruction from our Igwe. That is why I am offering to you people five plots of land now. Ah, uh, sir. Ten plots of land each. That is the least we can take. Ten plots of land? Yeah, you mean? <sighs> okay, okay. No problem. I agree. I agree. Order. 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 Bring her! My younger brother's daughter. Please, you release her. We must look for another man. It is too late. No, it, it is too late. late. It is too late. No, the sacrifice will not happen. No, bury her upside down here. No, 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 I will avenge my brother's death! I will avenge this woman's death! No, me! 
begging. No maiden in this land will ever marry as a virgin. No maiden. No maiden will ever marry the man that deflowered her. She will never put to bed for that man. And as for you out here, I will make you out pay. I will wipe away your entire generation and then make you suffer before you die. I will kill all of you. Why do you have to kill those two boys? Why? They were very unfortunate. Huh? That does not give you the reason to kill them. Huh? Yes. Huh? You mean we shouldn't leave them to go away with the secret like that? You don't understand. They are my family. It's here. Huh? It could have been your own biological family. Huh? Because we have to see how they land. Yes. Oh, uh, oh, 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 okay, 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 okay. Just go. Go and clean up the mess. Then come back for the land. Go, 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 go. <sighs> Stop crying. I will avenge what they did to you. Tell no one about it. I will make them pay. I will wipe away their entire generation.
Please. This is flogging me. <laughs> the girl is my phone. Ah! Okay. Yes, Igwe. My daughter was supposed to be used for the sacrifice. But I paid the man to release her. But I did not say they should kill her brother. Her mother or my brother. Oh, oh! Oh! You seek for the spirit of your ancestors to arise, but I overpower them. Henceforth, I shall be your goddess, and you must obey and worship me for the rest of your lives. <laughs> And their silence made the villagers assume and believe that I was the one who wiped my family out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Mama, I want to make her dear. Bala Gayadi. I want to go by a lie. You are sorry, Mama. I shall look on why. Nedima, please forgive us. We grew up hating you. When we should love you. We are deceived. We actually came to kill you. But after listening to your story, you realize how stupid we have been. We are sorry. Please, we are sorry. I'm 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 sorry. How do you expect me to forgive them? After what they did to me? No. I will never forgive these people. I feel your pains. I understand what you went through. How do you feel my pain? My father gave me to the oracle at a very young age simply because I refused to marry a man he wanted me to marry. He said instead of being a disgrace to him, it is better I'm serving the oracle. The forced me to take a life oath that I would know no man in my life. This is a punishment for disobeying him. I hated my father with passion. I attempted killing him at the end. I was left with no option than to forgive and forget. How do I forgive and forget? How do I put a smile on my mother's face when they taught their children to hate and disrespect my mother? Are you saying no one in this village loves your mother? Just one maiden. The maiden, is she married? No. I will never let her get married. How do you think she will feel? when she find out truly who you are. She will hate you. She will despise your mother. Because of this maiden, you have to forgive all. What? What do I do? You are a goddess. You are wiser than I am. You have to do your best. Yeah. I am so glad that we are all here together. I specifically called the elders in council and my beautiful Lola for this occasion. You all know why we are here. But it will be good for me to explain again. Many years ago, we took away everything that belonged to her. 
We lied against her. We made her an enemy to all of us. But today, we are giving back every single thing that we took away from her. There is a beautiful maiden sitting beside her. The maiden is going to stay with her. She will conceive and bear children. Yes. And the children will bear her name. Yes. All the major lands in the boundary of this, our community, will belong to those children that will be born unto her. The new house that was built behind my palace will belong to her and the children. Today, I am going to crown her as the mother of our land. Nebangi, Nani, Noma, Nora, Nora. I will crown her today. And as I'm going to do that, I want to let you know that this land called Ikoro will no longer be known as Ikoro land. Yes. Henceforth, it shall be called the land of Achala. Yeah. I am going to hand over the staff of office to the mother of our land. Nora Noru. Nalu Biko. This is a staff of authority. Twenty Nora. Nora. <laughs> I will have the pleasure of wearing you this myself. The B. And this will be her crown. Twenu Nora! Twenu Nora! Twenu Nora! Nora! Twenu Nora! Nora! They've done all what you asked them to do. Now it is your turn to do what you said. I will do what I told you. Then start by releasing Yukuku. How do you know she's here? Even if we break into the park, it don't. We sell your ego, my ego, your top. And you're as powerful as you are. No. I can't release her. She challenged me. You still bear grudges against your people. She won't do that which she promised. I will do it. Believe me. Then, release Ikuku. Release Ikuku. Thank you. Thank you. If I put up on a become a man, and that's a lot Oh, baby, don't look at me. Oh, baby, don't look at me. 